Hey guys, Science Bob here for the White House Science Fair. Look, the President, the White House, and I want you to know that science is everywhere. I mean, everywhere. From that little seed that you put in the ground that grows into a plant, to those many missions that NASA has sent into our solar system and beyond. Science is all around us. But you can do science too, right in your own home. There's a lot of easy experiments that you can try out with things that you already have in your house. Here's one of my favorites. It's a fun twist on a classic chemical reaction. Check it out. Hey, welcome back to our salute to vinegar and baking soda. How you doing, guys? All right, today's mission is to inflate a balloon using only vinegar and baking soda. Well, and a few other things. You're gonna need a plastic soda bottle. The smaller, the better. You're gonna need a balloon. The smaller, the better. And you're gonna need a funnel which you can use any size, really. All right, the first thing you wanna do is fill up the bottle with about three quarters of a cup of vinegar. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, that's vinegar. All right, there we go. And beautiful. Then, the tricky part. You need to fill the balloon with the baking soda. This is where the funnel comes in. But since you're probably already getting bored, I did this ahead of time. There we go. And now, you put the neck of the balloon over the neck of the bottle making sure that none of the baking soda inside actually goes in the bottle yet. Okay. This is, this is, this is. Now that the balloon is securely on the neck of the bottle, to start the reaction, we're gonna tip the balloon up, the baking soda will fall in, a chemical reaction will happen called an acid-base reaction. It will create carbon dioxide and hopefully fill the balloon. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Yeah, there, whoa, oh, okay, goodness. Oh. Three, two, one. Three, two, one, lift, and it's filling up. That's awesome. Excellent. Hey, you got all this stuff at home. Try it yourself. See what I mean? Science is for everyone. And the more you know about science, the more amazing the world becomes. So don't just sit there. Get out and explore. Until next time, for the White House Science Fair, this is Science Bob.